All right, all right, all right. So this is for the YouTube purposes. Introductions are in order for Catrican, a Fury Warrior God, a Healing God versus Kreiser, a Destruction Warlock. Catrican is getting in there, man. He's spending no time just dilly dallying. He's just gonna get some damage to Kreiser. Kreiser is gonna get a root emulate coming down. The cat is gonna be able to get a nice charge. It's gonna be a big old port out of Kreiser, trying to get away from the warrior, but he's not gonna let him run. And that's going to be a big old infernal coming down onto Cat. Kreis is going to go for some big damage right now onto the warrior. Big damage coming in. Trying to land a shot if you're going to get interrupted. Chaos bolts are going to be free with the reflect coming down. Kreis is not going to get Chaos bolted right now. Shot if you're trying to come out again. He's going to war stomp it. Chaos bolts are trying to come out. Fear comes in. He's actually locking out this warlock completely. Still trying to land a Chaos bolt with a wild charge shield coming in for Catrican. To use his big heal already versus infernal. Going to be a big old Chaos bolt out of this charge heal again. As Kreis is just pounding him with chaos bolts because he's trying to walk away but cat is not allowed trick is out of the pet cc right now big old warlock hellstone coming in shadow fury trying to come out for chrysler is gonna land that stun with a cat taking a chaos bolt into cataclysm charge heal still is gonna come out back to back after roots catch can still maintain his health burn himself through the infernal and it's continuing to burn the furious rush of what a fury war is all about trying to go in toe to toe and against the chaos bolt trying to take a port might be an execute range crisis is not looking that good trying to land a fear onto cat not gonna be able to an execute comes down cat cc it out chrysler is gonna turn him into dead mate first win goes to cat lived it to the very end chrysler versus cat very fast paced very quick duel at the opener and Katrika just healed through it. That was so much damage in a single setup. In a single go. Let's go, boys. Let's fucking go. There it is, man. All right, guys, the cat. Let me know when you guys are ready. That was so quick, man. Boom. Quick. Poor guy. Kreiser is going to be able to play with an open map. Going to get a demonic gateway. Katrikan is going to have to run. Early root coming in for Kreiser. Early pressure does get a dot into Katrikan, which is exactly what he wants. Cat is getting in there. Not going to get slowed by anything Kreiser throws at him. As Katrikan is actually going to avoid the pet CC with a blaze storm. Very well played. He's going to have a big old port leap coming in to follow for Cat after Kreiser. Infernal is going to come down with a bit of damage. Kreiser does want to get a big old setup with Chaos Bolt. going to get a CC onto Cat for a bit. Chaos Bolt's coming out early, trying to get as much Chaos Bolt damage while he's got it. And Cat is continuing to pump pressure while coming in for oh, for Cat, for Kreiser. Going to try to sling another Chaos Bolt to Cat. And Cat is going to heal through all those Chaos Bolt. Just going to stay in front of Kreiser. Kreiser is going to drop a Mally Trinket onto Cat right now. But I think he's just healed through it in like a single second. Another stun Chaos Bolt. Double Chaos Bolt going to arrive. Cat is trying to get a charge. Trying and maybe get a war stop onto Kreiser. Not gonna allow him for the Cataclysm. Cat got a massive heal. Going to be a pet CC. Trinkets it immediately. Imbolate coming down. Interrupts him onto fire. Catrican is still pounding pressure to Kreiser. Cataclysm is gonna finally connect. Does have reflect. I think it actually reflected back to Kreiser. It was an AoE that reflects. That's insane. Fear trying to come out. Catrican doesn't have fear in his body. Horror coming out right now. Though with an Emily can Kreiser get himself some range. Trying to go for fear onto Cat. That's a full fear. With a dot for Immolate. Cries are finally able to draw a breath of safety. Oh, finally this warrior is off of my back for at least a moment. But Cat is back in fully healthy. No trinket, no defensive. Does get a charge of a Kreiser in the opener. Pet CC comes in. Very short Pet CC. Cries is still continuing to run. No stuns for Katrikan. Katrikan is continuing to get as low as the Kreiser. Has a charge available whenever. Might even use it. Keep it slow as the Kreiser. Kreiser is just trying to run away from him. That's all he can do right now, chaining up the strategy. Gonna wait for some cooldowns. Finally has full mobility. Maybe he can use that to run way away from Cat. And Cat is gonna load him up so to mount. Root comes in at a distance. Gonna drop an early Cataclysm to Catrican. And Cat is gonna get a nice charge. Or effect coming in early with a fear. Is Cat gonna be able to get out of it? Chaos Bolt coming in into another Emily. Getting the long dot rolling. Hanging out by the port. Short CC by the Penetral. Shadow Fury into another Emily. Cycling through his CC with damage. Gonna get away. Cat is going to be able to hit the pet for a little bit. Going to get some heals off of the pet, but no charge heal at least. Going to pull the pet back where Kryzen needs to come to him. And Cat, the longest is behind there. And this is where Kryzen is going to pull the pet back. Very good play. Cat is trying to get the value damage off of it. Going to get a charge heal off of Kryzen though. With a root to fall. A cataclysm around the corner. Not going to hit Katrikan. Got right out of range. And Kryzen needs to pull the pet back every time. Katrikan is trying to slow the pet. It's going to be a big old port for Kryzen too. 
Mine is going to have to go for a resummon, is going to resummon another succubus. Catrican has his heal back, has a stun back, cries to survive through the powerful warrior. Trying to go for another hellstone, no interrupts himself on it. He's going to man up instead. And Catrican is going to chase after him, trying to get around, going to let out a big dragon's roar. Trying to show him who's the boss. Cries is continuing to run. Needs to play out the long game. Versus Catrican in the heels, it might be a difficult run. Does get the Pestis here off the bat into a Chaos Bolt. Cataclysm, no reflect for Cat. Gonna take a lot of the damage a little bit early. Prizes has all his cooldowns available. Infernal is gonna come down. Immolate to follow. Does want to make sure he has a pretty long dot onto Catrican. Maybe get some big damage. Is gonna get the AoE rolling. Might want to keep Catrican in that AoE. Kreiser is gonna go for some instant cast. Chaos Bolts are gonna come out. Maybe reflect for Cat. No, trying to bait out Reflect. Chaos Bolt finally coming out. Reflect coming in. Gonna reflect back into Kreiser. No wall available anymore. Actually, reflects his own horror. Take us out of that horror with a blade storm coming out for Cat. Another Chaos Bolt coming in with a pet to see for a moment. Does get interrupted onto Chaos. Nothing he can do as he gets interrupted on Chaos. He's locked out of everything. Mally Trigger coming down onto Catrican, I think. And I think Catrica just heals through all of it. Shadow Fury coming down with a Chaos Bolt to follow. Maybe a fear after this. Cataclysm trying to make its way out. Does land a uh, um, Cataclysm onto Cat. With a root after a big old leap charge, and that's gonna be a root mid charge. Massive play by Kreiser. That's gonna be Reflect trying to come out. Maybe he can get a pet to see. Is gonna be able to use Warlock Gateway to get away. Another root onto Cat. Another charge comes in, has him in the execute range. Pet CC comes in on the last ditch effort. Kreiser barely has any health, but finally has the range away from Cat. With a Chaos Bolt, Immolate to follow. Cat is just running at him. Charge comes into the pet. So he can catch up to Kreiser. Big horror effect coming down with a fear to follow. And Kreiser slinging more damage from a distance is going to continue the emulate running. The pet is going to get back to Cat, is going to heal off it for a little bit. Finally, going to get himself a Hellstone working. Cat out there with a pretty mean dot, long dot, which is exactly what Kreiser was looking for. Put a longer dot on him, pandemic it out, like by applying first emulate, then a second one. It's going to be reflect as Cat gets in there. If you're trying to come out, maybe pets the seam. Gonna break out of it. Gonna root Cat again. Shadow Fury to follow. Get in trouble. And Shadow Fury cares, but it's going to hit though. Kreiser could go for another stun. Is gonna try to land a fear onto Cat. Blaze from coming down. Gonna break it out of it. Fear coming in again. Is gonna land a fear in that execute range. No, couldn't quite root him and charge. Is gonna end up taking him out and execute. Best out of three, and Kadrika takes it. Between the massive heals that a Fury Warrior can do, reflect. Uh even short like racial stun, which is he doesn't even use like a normal stun. And fear. That's a lot of ways to deal with Kreiser. Kreiser has the defensive nature with a demon armor. Very defensive. Has the succubus for a little bit extra CC to help him out. Is dealing against a warrior who can deal with charms and fears pretty easily. With enraged regen. Oh. No. Rage, Berserk, Berserker's rage. So this is going to be an interesting fight. Cat is running in there. Kreiser is setting up in the opener. That's going to be Cat getting the first hit. Kreiser is taking him out in the open. Is going to get a CC by the pet. Is Kreiser going to go for big damage or is he going to go for a CC chain? Trying to get as much distance as he can with a Cataclysm root onto Catrican. Maybe some damage. Cat is going to turn around and start hitting the pet immediately. Going to line inside it. Just macking down the pet. Building up a lot of rage off of it so he can charge to Kreiser with some big burst damage. It's going to be Infernal, but it's going to be a Blaze Storm to stop the stun. Out of that Infernal, Kreiser is going to go for some big damage. Chaos Blood coming out, out of that Horror Effect, into an Immolate, into a Root, Short Root onto Catrican. Cat is going to go for Reflect, Dodge Force out, and Reflect out of Cat a little bit early. Going to go for a Wallace, Cat is going to go for massive heals. Kreiser is going to be able to survive this damage and get some free damage to Cat, but Cat is healing a lot. Going to be a Trinket out of that pet, pet CC, into a Mallet Trinket onto Catrican. Going to be able to heal through that pretty quickly, I think. Going to get a Fear on all the pets, Trinket coming down on Kreiser, and Cat is going to line for a little bit gonna hit the pet to reheal a little gonna get a lot of rage out of it charge comes in to start uh to heal off of cat is gonna be berserker rage coming down to deal with a fear for now shadow fear trying to come down is gonna land it case coming down into a full cataclysm gonna be a lot of damage into a root into cat no way to use that warlock port right now use it a little bit early charge comes in cat is a full of health as he gets hit with a cc crisis like you know what oh my god i just started to get some work done in you eat a chaos bolt and hold it down for a moment cat is just getting in there with another charge heal off of that double charge no stuns needed or effect to separate these two fear finally going to come out onto the warrior with a <laughs> with a big old chaos bolt slamming him down in his back now the chaos bolt getting wound up gonna be an interrupt though by cat 
continuing to get some damage into Chrysler, continuing to passively heal another Kezbo trying to come down, trying to force out a defensive out of Cat. He's going to be reflect, did force out a reflect, could go for some damage after this. Could be an interrupt this time though. Is going to get the pet CC as Chrysler does get some range away from Cat. Going to go for Kezbo, Cataclysm probably root to follow. Is going to probably get a root. No, I think he did get a root, but Cat is right there next to the pet. Is able to get some healing off of the pet after going to get him with a root as he's about to charge. Cries, I think, needs to root Catrican's charges like when he's mid charge. Root him. Shadow getting locked out over that Shadow Fear. Trying to get a Chaos Bolt up and running. Decided to cancel it. Going to go for a heal instead with a Fear. Is Cat going to be able to break out of it? Does break out of it. Going to be a long emulate rolling onto Cat. And Chrysler is going to be able to port away, but a big leap is available for Chrysler. Going to get hit with a interrupt onto Shadow Fury. Like that, a Shadow going to still land that Shadow Fury. Needs to go for some CC. Going to go for a Fear. Shortest Fear of his life. Charge comes in and Crash can Just has so much rage available. Chrysler is trying to go for some damage. Has big crits available. Trying to land a Chaos Bolt. Not going to see a Reflect on a Cat right now. Now it's going to be an interrupt. Chrysler is locked out completely. Blaze Room comes out. And down it goes. And up next, we're going to have a bonus duel. Purple Haze versus Dirk's Brian. Dirk's Brian, fully fed. Has some food. But now for Purple. And Chrysler versus Cat. Very well played. That's a hard fight. Cat is a warrior. Lots of people don't expect a warrior to do well in duels. So I got to give him the credit, man. Chrysler is insane against just about everybody. And he defeated Cat before. But if Cat takes everything to deal with a caster reflect uh if you go i guess reflect is the only big wombo combo because normally he doesn't have reflect that's one less ability that Kryza has to deal with as a warlock we're gonna be purple haze versus dirks dirks gonna go for a stun into mali with a kill and spear onto purple purple is gonna be able to go with a um, imprison onto dirks gonna be able to get a rainfall above no no vanish coming up for Dirk. He's going to get a line of sight and a bit of heal. Double concoction coming down so he can get a massive heal. No dampening quite yet. Nurse is trying to set up for a damage combo. Trink coming down out of that stun with an interrupt onto Ivy. Metamorph is coming down for purple. He's going to hit with a stun by the road. Going to go for a relentless. So the CC is going to eat the CC. But it's simply just not going to be nearly as long. That blind is going to be a shorter blind by about a second or so. Maybe. Side comes in into purple haze. That's gonna be a reheal for Dirk's gonna open up with a cheap shot. Short cheap shot though. With a stun to fall in. Purple is just gonna bail away for a second. Another stun come down. Gonna be another stun by purple trying to get a wombo combo set up, but that's gonna be a parry out of Dirk's force out a big defensive. That's where purple is just trying to bail away from Dirk's, trying not to deal with the parry. Doesn't want to hit into it. Now that the parry is down, this is where purple gets to get offensive, but. Dirks is going to be getting some range. He has grapple hook, but Purple does see it, does catch him, and does move over to the other side of the pillar. Dirks is trying to catch himself. Restealth not going to happen with a blade dance as Purple Haze goes up in the air. Vanish does come out of the rogue, and 1% dampening is starting to set in. Might be a good idea for Purple for dampening to set in because Dirks just heals for a ton every time he gets a reset. Dirks is going to go for a cheap shot onto Purple Haze. going to be a shorter cheap shot than what he expects it usually. With it between the eyes to follow, stun comes in onto Durek's eye beam after. He's going to be able to get a Mally rolling onto Durek. He's going to cloak or shadows it with a killing spree. He's still going to be able to continue lighting purple. Purple still trying to get in. Dark is going to drop down right now, stunning Durek's in here. And Durek's is going to run as far away as he can. Just going to slink himself all the way to the other side of the pillar. So hero needs purple. I think lagging a little bit. Now he's good. Now he's good. Blade dance to follow. Dirk does have a drone rush rolling, trying to get a setup. Stun comes in into purple. No way to get out of these stuns. Mally trick it to fall. Lots of damage into purple. Stun comes in onto Dirk into a Bombo combo, but the Demon Hunter does get leashed for a little bit from the Metamorphosis, but Dirk is going to slink behind the pillar again. Got a really good roll for damage and healing. Cheap shot open onto purple. Going to go up in the air. Trying to get some pot shots. Hit Katrickin by accident. Not going to be able to hit Dirk as he catches up a restyle. Sap comes in, and I think. Purple Haze is going to go down to Dirks. Too much healing out of the Rogue. The back-to-back -back stuns are making this duel a lot difficult. A lot more difficult for Purple Haze than it really should be. Back-to-back -back cheap shot into between the eyes. And Dirks does end up taking him out. Well played. Well played by both Dirks, Purple, but also well played by Katrickin and Kryza. Both of these guys are good to go. Both of these guys are good. No way against an outlaw. Yeah, that's a hard one, man. That's a hard one. I agree. 
Your elder heals are out of control, but everybody's fine, actually. You think so? They are pretty big in heals, man.